What's up guys, Nolan here, and I was really hoping to be playing 12.7 today, but it doesn't look like that's going to happen. So while we are still waiting for 12.7, I got some gameplay of an interesting little tear that I went on while I was farming Gluhar a couple weeks back. This is my specific Glue Boy farm kit and farm, where I would just sprint to his spawns and see if he was there. I like this kit because nothing is limited and I can kill anything relatively easily. As long as I have the cash, I can buy this kit as much as I want. It doesn't matter how many times I die. I can immediately just buy it again and head back out, which is perfect for farms that involve you literally running down the middle of roads on reserve. In this particular raid, your boy Glucose wasn't there, so after ruining a pistoling duo and a hatchling's day, I turned the alarm on and made my way to the hermetic door to grab the raiders on my way out. Now, I have a teaching point for the end of this video, so I will be back, but if you don't make it through the whole video, fingers crossed 12.7 pops up soon, and I hope you have a nice day. Be back in a minute, guys.
So that right there was dumb. I got too cocky and overthought a simple kill. I was running up this metal roof at triple K to grab the player scav camping the hill when I thought maybe if I make a bunch of noise going more to the right, he'll think I kept moving, then went back and peeked. I then didn't move high enough and when I should have only been thinking about killing this guy, I was thinking about not shooting the roof and that hesitation along with the perfect shot from that player scav got me killed. This right here is why I love Escape from Tarkov. Every moment counts. It doesn't matter that I just killed six or more players and a bunch of scavs. I am still as vulnerable as always and if something is a dumb idea then it will always be a dumb idea. If you screw up there's very little if anything to catch you. Believe me guys over the years of dying in this game the best deaths are the most brutal because you can learn so much from them and they stick around in your mind. If you actually think about it how many good plays do you remember compared to the bad plays? Cool thing about video games is it's not just live and learn there's plenty of dying and learn as well. That's it for today, guys. Fingers crossed on 12.7. It really should be any day now. In fact, I was thinking it would be today, but we'll see. All we can do is wait. If you want to learn anything about Escape from Tarkov or its development, then you can check out my playlist for it here. If you're looking for people to play with, then you can join our Discord below. If you like this video, then you know the drill. I really appreciate the people who do. Otherwise, I hope you at least learned something, and I also hope you have a nice day. See you guys.